soldiers from the Fort Stewart U.S. Army Medical Department Activity Ambassadors Program volunteered with Islands High School on Wilmington Island as part of their Teens in the Driver's Seat campaign. Teens in the Driver's Seat is a critical program for students that are getting ready to start driving and those that are currently driving because it's a way for there to be some peer-to-peer -peer conversation about the importance of safe driving practices. MEDAC Ambassadors Staff Sergeant Gillespie Washington and Staff Sergeant Stephanie King volunteered their time to participate in the Teens in the Driver's Seat campaign. So when we got here and I found out that the group was called Teens in the Driver's Seat and it was about the safeness of teaching the teens how to drive, I felt like it was an important program, not just for the teens and high schoolers, but for everyone. The soldiers took shifts tallying up key factors from student drivers about what can affect their driving vigilance. Student drivers were checked for seatbelt obedience and most of all, cell phone use while driving. To reached out to the ambassadors to come and support the teens. I felt like coming here, they, they supported me, they taught me, and they showed me, hey, you need to go out and tell your adult friends, hey, you need to drive safe, put on your seatbelt, don't be distracted, don't text and drive. According to the National Highway and Safety Administration, 10% of drivers aged 15 to 19 years old who were involved in fatal crashes were distracted while driving. We have lots of students that are injured or even killed as a result of vehicle accidents and many of those students would not have been injured or not have been killed had they been wearing seat belts or not participating in, in dangerous behavior. And, and the way I look at this, if every kid that's a part of our Teens in the Driver's Seat program learns something and can encourage at least one person that they know to make better choices with driving, our kids are going to be a lot safer. Diana Shiley, a teacher at Islands, is the main facilitator of the Teens in the Driver's Seat campaign. Shiley stressed the importance of providing an atmosphere that allows students to provide guidance on their negative driving habits to other students. Teens listen to teens. Rather than having adults lecture about the, the dangers, they'll listen to each other and follow the lead. And so our goal is hopefully to lower the, the number of students who are using electronic devices while they're driving. To have kids about the same age as the students that we saw today. It really brings it home. I do have kids that will be driving soon, and to be a part of the mission today, it, it really puts something in me that shows that, hey, this is something I need to be aware of in my own home, and I think that was very important. After all data was tallied, MENAC ambassadors and island students and faculty members met to discuss a strategic communications campaign that would help mediate the distracted driving problem. To win Army Community Hospital Public Affairs, I'm Zach Renstrom.